With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, here the question is a convex lens of focal length 20 cm and a concave mirror having their principal axis along the same lines. Okay, the principal axis along the same lines are kept 80 cm from each other. The concave mirror is to the right of the convex lens when an object is kept at a distance of 30 cm left of the convex lens its image remains at the same position even if the concave mirror is removed the maximum distance of the object for which the concave mirror by itself would produce a virtual image will be what means we have to find the focal length okay focal length of the concave mirror okay so let's draw the red diagram okay see here Here, okay. Here, this is the convex lens. Okay, this is the convex lens. Okay, and this is the what this is the concave mirror. Okay, and the separation between the lens and the mirror is given 80 centimeter. Means this distance is. 80 centimeter okay see here it is the pole and here it is the pole for the concave mirror okay so the question is saying that when an object is kept at a distance of 30 centimeter left of the convex lens means the object is here okay. and this distance is 30 means this distance is 30 centimeter the object is a b and and focal length of the convex lens is given 20 centimeter means this is the f and this distance is 20 centimeter okay so here the separation of the lens and the mirror is given 80 centimeter the situation is even though you remove the concave mirror the position of the image found by the convex lens in the same position okay so what is the maximum distance at which a concave mirror can produce a virtual image the image is it can usually produce a virtual image when the object is kept between the focus and pole of the concave mirror okay so and we have to calculate the distance between that okay so let, let us draw it okay so first we will find the image distance of the convex lens okay so we know the formula lens formula that is 1 by v minus 1 by u is equal to 1 by f which implies that 1 by v is equal to 1 by f plus 1 by u the focal length is given 20 centimeter of the convex lens and the this u is given is what 30 centimeter okay it is, it is the object distance okay which is kept left to the convex lens okay so by the sign conventions we will find the b so 1 by v is equal to 1 by f plus 1 by minus what 30 okay so f is equal to 20 so it is equal to 1 by v is equal to 1 by 20 minus 1 by 30 so implies that 1 by v is equal to 1 by 60 so implies that v is equal to 60 centimeter okay so get our image distance is equal to 60 centimeter means the if the image is formed here okay so the image is formed here okay so this distance is 60 so we will let, let us draw okay so this distance is what this distance is 60 centimeter see here in the convex lens the object is behind the focus okay behind the focal length okay so the image will formed behind the focal length and 2 f1 okay between the focus f1 and 2 f1 here is the 2 f1 okay so the image will form beyond 2f1 okay so this is the 2f1 the image is formed here so the image will be what enlarged real and inverted okay so the next next the question is saying that the image formed by the mirror coincides with the image formed by the lens it means that since the image forms the, on the same position this is the image is the source of object for the concave mirror hence 
in order to produce the image in the same position what could be the condition it means that the object should be kept in the center of curvature okay see so this position will act as c for the the center of curvature for the concave mirror so if the, this is the center of curvature this is the focus and we have to calculate the distance between the focus and the pole in order to produce a virtual image by a concave mirror so this distance we will have to calculate okay so in order to calculate it we have to find the radius of curvature so radius of curvature is equal to 80 minus 60 this distance is 80 and this distance is 60 so we will find the radius of curvature that is equal to 20 centimeter and okay so we know that r is equal to 2f this is the formula okay so in order to calculate the focal length we have to put this okay so r is given 20 is equal to 2 into f implies that f is equal to 20 by 2 is equal to 10 centimeter so this is the focal length okay, of the concave mirror okay means this is the focal length means if the image is placed behind the focus and the pole of the concave mirror and the image and the distance is 10 centimeter okay we will get our virtual image means this object should be placed between 10 centimeter to the left of the concave mirror so that we will get a virtual image so this is our answer okay this is our answer which is equal to 10 centimeter okay so we will now look into the options so in the options it is in the what it is in the third option so this is the answer and hope you get your answer and thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today